Ricardo Talio. Today I'm going to be looking at the Asus Vivo Mini VC66. Now, this one particularly is the VC66R. The difference between the VC66 and the VC66R is the R stands for RAID. Now, I do recommend you get the RAID model. If you want to use this as a NAS or like a server or something like that, you'll be able to use that RAID function. Now, I have actually reviewed another Asus Mini PC. I'll leave links in the description of the card up here. You can have a look at that, but this one here is the daddy of the mini PCs because this one here uses full desktop CPUs. We're talking full desktop 7th generation i7 7700 CPUs in here. So you're going to get max performance there. The great thing about this is you can have up to 32 gigabytes RAM, but even more impressive, you can have two two and a half inch drives and an M.2 SSD. So that's amazing. So that's where that RAID function comes in. Being able to have two like hard drives or SSDs you can mirror them you can have some backup redundancy there and it's quite a nice looking unit it's matte black and matte black is all in fashion now the only thing I will say is you can mark it a little bit but you can rub those marks off it does show up marks a little bit there but the matte black nice matte black finish it's pretty compact considering it houses a, a full desktop CPU in it has so dim so it uses the laptop style RAM because obviously being so small it would need that easy to upgrade and install the stuff yourself on the front you have two usb 2.0s two usb 3.0s and the audio jack on the back you have two usb 3.1 gen ones one dvid one hdmi one display port one ethernet jack a com port and you have the power in there and you also have a four in one sd card reader there so it's loaded with ports has a 120 watt power supply so it is very power efficient too so you can use this as like a little tiny workstation. You can visa mount them on the back of monitors so you can keep a clean setup. Full desktop performance as I said. It outputs 4K so it's great for home theatre. And with the triple storage options there and particularly in this model here with the RAID feature. It's great to use as a NAS or a little server. Wireless Bluetooth built in of course and you actually get 100 gigabytes of free ASUS web storage as well. And what's great too is you also have ASUS business manager it's a remote managing tool for getting into the pc so so that sort of ties in with being able to use this as a nas or like a server noise and heat no problems it plays casual games it'll do all your multimedia functions all your productivity stuff no problems it doesn't get hot or throttle the only thing i will say is the fan you will hear it every now and then it sort of goes up and down i would probably prefer a fan curve where it stays off for longer and it doesn't come on till it really gets hot and then ramps up really fast i prefer that than sort of coming on and off sort of all the time but other than that and it marks a little bit they're the only downsides this is a fantastic little mini pc raid built in server nas home theater great for business or home it packs a punch in this little box here so what we have here is the daddy of mini pcs i mean this thing is epic just having a look at it look it has that squared sort of look it's actually bigger than the other mini pc i reviewed uh, you can check out that review on that one but this one is full desktop performance we're talking a full desktop grade up to i7 7 700 there so this thing here can literally replace your desktop, no problems whatsoever. And having a look at it, I do like that design there. It is a bit of a fingerprint magnet there, but um, it is matte black, looks beautiful. On the front here, you have your headphone, microphone jack, you have USB-C, awesome. You have USB 3.1 and two USB 2s. So I don't see many of these mini PCs with USB-C. That's the power button there has this nice squared off look and sort of interesting graphics on the side and being able to replace your full desktop here you get all the ports as well you even get com ports dvi out legacy sort of connection there um, power jack in there sd card slot usb 3.1s with power share uh, ethernet display port hdmi it has everything you need a mounting plate so you can visa mount these so you can actually mount these at the back of display so you can put them 
literally at the back mount them there i see this done all the time now here's the power brick it is fairly big but you got to remember it's 120 watts and it's powering a full desktop class processor in there so this literally can replace your desktop you also get your instruction manuals and various screws now what is so special about this is you can have two two and a half inch drives in there so you can put an m.2 ssd in there plus two two and a half inch drives so that means two two and a half inch ssds or two two and a half inch hard drives not only can this be your home theater pc but it also can be used as it's like a server or a nas being able to use two two and a half inch drives means you can raid it so you can put it in raid backup redundancy there and this is a fantastic device to replace your desktop and not have an ugly box and how good does it look set up here with this beautiful monitor looks fantastic nice and clean it is a nice looking device and there you can see all the the uh, mini pcs that azus have but this one here this is the one i would go for just because of that desktop processing power and the ability to have two two and a half inch hard drives makes it so flexible clean have a look at it beautiful so guys i'd really like to thank you for watching if you're new around here why not subscribe and until next time guys tally ho